enable some me on a Sunday morning. And he said, Girl, you're beautiful. How do you manage to stay beautiful in a world that keeps falling apart? Then I smiled. If only he knows the story of my independence. If only he asked for my story. I wanted to tell him that my lustrous skin and beauty are not natural. That I became violent and I took them by force. I wanted to tell him that my long hair and cat eyes I wasn't born with. That they came from the walls and fought. From fighting the wrong wars and enemies. That they came from the conquers I suffered and the victories I won. I wanted to tell him there were scars. And they healed from turning to God, the mender of clays. I wanted to tell him it took years. Years of believing the wrongs. To my eyes, you are open to the rights. That I too seeking for love in men. Till I discovered divine love in front of me. That I took being hot and broken and crushed and then running to God, the healer of hearts. That I took being hit in the head with a hammer till you are just a bag of flesh. That I took being a bag of flesh and then fixing your bones one at a time till you build something close to the skeleton of the skeleton you used to be. That I took tears and tears and lies and lies and a little more lie till you hunger for truth. That it took being darkness but letting your black shine so hard till it lost stars into light. That I took having a past, a dirty past, but taking a bold step into the future because you know God is there. That I took being ugly, but refusing to be ugly by letting God do the job of a makeup kit in your life, concerning your marks with forgiveness and love, spreading the foundation for faith and hope, and painting your lips and eyes with joy. That surpasses even your own understanding. I wanted to tell him my story. I wanted to show him my scars. But he didn't ask. So, before he left, I told him almost in a whisper, you too can be beautiful. <laughs>